Hey there Excel Wizards and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to be discussing the dreaded hashtag REF error in the sum function, and trust me, it's a real pain in the spreadsheet. But before we get into the nitty gritty, let's set the scene with some dummy data. Imagine you have a spreadsheet with sales figures for your company's products, like the one below. In this sheet, we have a table of sales figures for products A, B, and C for each quarter of the year. In this sheet, we have a formula in cell A2 that is supposed to calculate the total sales for product A by summing the values in the Q1 sales, Q2 sales, Q3 sales, and Q4 sales columns on sheet 1. But, let's say in sheet 1 we accidentally deleted the row 2 which contains product A data, so the formula in sheet 2 will reference to a non-existing cell, which will result in the hashtag REF error. Now, let me tell you, this error is not just a simple oopsie or hoopsie like some other errors. No, no, no. This error is a holy crap, what did I do wrong kind of error. So, what causes this error? Well, my dear wizards, it's usually caused by a reference to a cell or range that is not valid, like in our example where the reference to product A data was deleted. But don't worry, there's always a solution to this error. You can simply edit your formula to reference the correct cells or ranges, in this case it will be equal sum, sheet 1, C5, F5, to reference the correct cells for product B. And that's it for today's lesson on the hashtag REF error in the sum function. Remember, always double check your formulas and references to avoid this frustrating error. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time on our channel.